Hello and welcome to this part of Let's Play Theme Hospital. Alright, let's continue on, shall we? Yeah. Still in Sleepy Hollow. Trying to get to the winning. Still need to pay off that loan. And all of a sudden all our patients have dried up. I don't want my consultant to leave. Let's see, there's currently 2 patients, 17 plans, 15 fire extinguishers, 22 rooms. No, that can't be right. Yeah, no shit, if there's no patients. Ah. There are my little money bags. Oh, this is no good. You're going to rest. I'm not entirely sure what causes that. But occasionally doctors will overwork themselves. Maybe it's something to do with being uh, too dedicated. I don't know. There. Do something useful. Did I turn off that they can't leave the rooms? No, it's... they can leave. Doctor Ricardi, GP's office. Very strange. At least the consultant will get rid of his tiredness quickly. Let's see, I've got two nurses, six doctors. Right, I've cured enough patients. Now I just need to make money, and I will have one. And if people want to come here. Now I'm getting close to critical mass of reputation. But suddenly the entire population of the world is in here. Of this country, is it? Come on, doctors, move those legs. Okay, that means my consultant is going to go in the GP's office. All right, still no new doctors. Come on, give me something good. Come on. How big is the line? It's not too big yet. I have seen worse. Yes, another consultant. And damn, I'm out of money. Don't bother me. Right, come on, give me money. Doctor, come 
on, give me more money. There. That should be enough, doctors. Psychiatrist. Mm. Yeah, gonna take you off research duty. Benches at the Slack Tongue Clinic. <laughs> All right, get that fixed. That's no good. Once the vomiting starts, you're in trouble. Yeah, yeah clean that up. And that's all you do. It's about bloody time. Consular Crawford Purse. Alright. Too many doctors. Yes, I know. I need all of them, though. You're wrong. I'm right. And you are tired. Get T to the staff room before you start complaining about your wages. Alright. You can go do regular stuff now. How you can talk with a tongue like that? Astounding. Where did the hat and cane go? And the watch. Well, I suppose he could still be wearing the watch, but... Why is his clothing invisible when the hat and the glasses are not? Overuse? Really? Mm, slicer is fine. I don't want to replace the machines just yet. Cardio is also still fine. Yeah. Search for that. I don't know, is there a way to check s the inflator? <laughs> Can't afford to replace it yet. It's also not smoking, so not really in danger. And 
I'm getting there, but I'm not quite yet. Where I need to be. It's usually always the money that's what's keeping you back. Especially if you play expensive like I do. Alright. I'm still in the same place in the Hall of Shame. That's fine. Still not the richest, but I am positive. That's good. My salary is the highest. Yay. Ooh, they already have deaths, and I still have zero, which means a trophy bonus. I cured the most people, and I'm second place in most visitors. Which trophies did I get? Uh, best of reputation, most valuable hospital, the cleanest hospital, the bullfrog can walk for highest reputation. That's always nice. The life goes on. Corporation gives me a reward. And... Ah, I get an award for selling soft drinks. That's fine. And I win! Dearly you, you have been vastly successful during your tenure at this hospital. To this end, we predict there are great things for you and would like to offer your position elsewhere. The salary would be... Uh, that number. And we think you'd love the new challenge it would pose. Would you accept like a position at Larchester Hospital? Of course I would. Level 3. Alright. Alright, so we can get emergencies. And we get some new... Ooh! Operating theatre! Yeah! That's what I want. That's what I want. Next.